Does eating too much carb affect my gain? Do I need to eat carbs at all? Isn't the such thing as good and bad carbs, okay? People like to throw these words around. These are good carbs, these are bad ones. You are in the calorie surplus. Your muscle may not be as defined as you may want it to be. And sometimes based on your genetics, some people may be at a surplus with a very defined, a well-defined muscle, and that is their genetic. And uh, there isn't uh, uh, a thing that you and I can do about it. This is just his anatomy and physiology, genetic, like I said. But uh, the thing like bad carbs and good carbs, I would like to say you need to have your nutrition very balanced and uh, don't hang on to the uh, bad and the good carbs thing people throw around me. Because I can give you an example, it's like white rice and brown rice, white bread and brown bre bread, okay? When it comes to uh, those food, you might eat brown bread and uh, we all say it is the healthiest alternative but if you eat too much of those brown bread, it's, it's, it has the same effects on your metabolism as a white bread. Let's say you eat too much of brown bread and a little piece of white bread. Based on the amount of calorie you put in with the brown uh, bread, it might have a negative effect on you than the white bread that you ate. Uh, like I say, it comes down to calorie in and calorie out. The thing here is that how much are you eating and how much uh, workout are you doing? Are you eating and going immediately to sleep? There's, there's so many different factors that play a role into uh, your metabolism and your calorie in and calorie out. Some people have fast metabolism and some have uh, slow metabolism. So uh, a person with a slow metabolism might eat the perfect portion, okay? The perfect, the perfect portion has someone with a, um, a fast metabolism. They may not have uh, the, same, the same muscle definition and results in terms of muscle gains and, the, and their journey. Everyone have their own individual journey. The goal is for you to build muscle, but then you need to understand your physiology and your anatomy. You, you are a unique person, okay? What applies to uh, someone else's may not apply to you. That's what I say, it's not a one size fit all thing when it comes to nutrition. That's why giving nutritional advice and, uh, and giving absolute nutritional advice and say, this food is going to make you gain weight, this food is going to make you lose weight, is an absolute statement. A person will not know about that uh, by just uh, looking at you, it just because, and, and telling you, hey, if you eat the brown rice, it's good for you, the white rice. Uh, you know, just these are just things out there. Uh, it's not a one size fit all. You need to know who you are and what might work for me. I have my own nutri nutritional plan. There are things that I eat that someone out there who may eat the same thing as me and not gain the same muscle as, as I do. You know, they might gain uh, the muscle faster or slower. It depends on your metabolism and your genetic makeup. So therefore, the, the, the aspect of nutrition is very complex and uh, don't take nutritional advice uh, from anybody. If they are not uh, certified, you need to really take the advice with a grain of salt. That's why on my page here, I cannot tell you, um, I, I cannot make an absolute statement when it comes to nutrition. I can just give you a general, a general knowledge like, hey, these food are known to, to, to build muscle, I mean, to help you build muscle. But then I don't know your physiology though. So therefore, what works for me or work for a fitness guru, outdoor or enthusiast may not work for you and I. So therefore, uh, don't, don't apply the same uh, nutritional journey to yours, okay? You need to, um, to know your, yourself before you proceed. I know, I know it's very tempting uh, to, to want to have the same nutritional uh, plan as your favorite uh, fitness uh, enthusiast or fitness channel, whoever it is that you really fancy, you want their body, their look, and you think if you eat like them, you're going to gain the muscle that they have, or be like them, or be better than them. It's fine. For me, I would like to say it's not a one size fit all. One may work for them nutritionally, may not work for you. And I know I keep repeating myself. It's about time I stop it. 
So you get the the, the <laughs> you get the chest hmm? of my of of my message. You get the point of my message. It's not one size fit all. Oh, it works for them. You know, work for you and I. That's the only message I am giving you right now. It's concrete and honest and straight to the point. Take it. Look at grain of salt. <laughs> Bye.